Well, hello again, folks. Shell Buzzy here with information on my Ask Shell referral network members. And I've been doing these now for some weeks. And what I'm trying to do for you is to bring forth the personality of our service trades to you. And tonight, for example, we have a young gentleman that is uh, operating a company called Fantastic. Well, Fantastic actually is a service for you to clean a lot of those items in and around your home, even your car if it comes to a real messy upholstery job. And his name is Zachary. And how are you, Zachary? Very good, thank you. And it's nice to be here with you. Well, it's not something every day that you uh, do, and you don't always get that opportunity yeah. uh, to uh, right. have the experience of being on a video. But uh, hey, right. this is what we like to do. Bring that personality out. Bring that big smile of yours out and talk about the things that you do day after day after day, mm -hmm. as I do, taking care of the home services that people that, uh, well, need that job done around the home that, that I supply the services for. Yep. And I know that you're involved in everything from cleaning carpet to uh, to wood floors, but tell me, carpeting is is your your whole likelihood it'd be called on area carpets, or is it wall to wall carpet, or is it indoor outdoor carpet, is it on patio? Do you do all carpets? All, yeah, I've had experience since since I I could um, hold the machine and buffer, and I've learned from the best, and I enjoy it. You learn from the best and now yeah. you know the rest. Yeah. And that's getting the job done. That's what right. are some of the jobs that you find on carpet uh, today? What about wine spills? And uh, what about those real greasy, mm -hmm. sticky items like syrups and what have you? Do you get involved in that time? Oh, yeah. They're definitely the most difficult, but we do the best we can and at the very least lightens it up. Well, least. I know the number of years that... Uh, uh, fantastic has been associated with uh, my yep. Shell Buzzy Ask Shell uh, referral network. I've never had a customer <laughs> yet get back to me with the exception of those that get back saying, gosh, did they ever do a great job? And that's why you call it not fantastic, but fantastic. That's right. And fantastic being the name of the creator of the name branding of yep. fantastic floor cleaning. And that's where you come in and that's where you're working. Well, mm -hmm. tell me though, you got uh, tiles, you do showers. I know showers are big. What yeah. are the type of things you run into on showers? Uh, well, the caulking, it, it lasts as long as it does, but if the person or the owner isn't maintaining it or it, just eventually the mildew will get in and it needs to be replaced. So that's a major one as well as just the grout so you clean time. all the grout, yep. do all the bases, get rid of all that black staining yep, and uh, what some people call mold and I call algae, which yep. uh, algae is that starting of a mold mm -hmm. spore, but also you seal the yep. uh, the grout afterwards. That's and right. How often should that be done? Uh, well, usually it's recommended every two years, but yeah, two years is probably... All depends on yeah. how much... Yeah. That's right. uh, they pay attention to housekeeping that's, around that's the right. home. That's right. And you know, I've always uh, said that any time that uh, you have a shower, you should always take the soiled uh, towel after drying yourself mm -hmm. off and wipe everything down. That's right. Because exhaust fans in the ceiling are not pumps. They don't pump the water away. They actually, the evaporation has to take place and then it's exhausted. So if you can limit the amount of water by mm -hmm. drying it with a towel, makes a big, big difference. That's right. What about the bases? Some people, uh, mm, housework is not something that they really are inclined to do. And uh, I'm not gonna be down on anybody that uh, uh, might be younger than the average person that uses a shower all the time. But I know it's a training process to get people mm -hmm. to uh, dry down first on the uh, using that towel. Is That's it? right. It takes quite a, quite a while to get into the habit of keeping it as dry as possible. Getting to sink in, so yeah. to speak, yeah. And, and I'm not going to, because, hey, we've had two daughters and uh, we two grandsons now, and, and I know getting them to do it makes, mm -hmm. it's like sometimes uh, tightening a screw, but going uh, <laughs> counterclockwise instead of uh, clockwise. But also natural stone. You get involved in natural stone, like countertops. and Yeah, natural stone. Usually it's, you see it in some showers, and but mainly... Mainly countertops. Yeah, like your granites and uh, marbles. Yeah. 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 Do you ever get into a real toughy that's uh, very porous and that uh, staining gets into the uh, the marble and the and the granite? 
Yeah, it's also the scratches as well. Yeah. The ones that go really deep. Um, so that's always uh, time consuming. And you can clean those. Only. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Cleaning, sealing. What about the bases? What are the what are the best type of bases that you find to clean? The ceramic tile ones, the marble ones, or the 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 uh, composite ones? Uh, do you mean the easiest? Yeah. Uh, I'd say usually ceramic, porcelain. Yeah. Those ones are. It's smooth. It's not porous, so it's. They come up beautifully. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, makes a real difference. I know that. And incidentally, folks, we mm -hmm. have ours done at home every two years, and it's just one of those things that even though we do. Uh, tile them down, but still, it's something to get rid of in the grout lines and to get those grout lines yeah. clean and sealed. Mm -hmm. So it really makes a difference. Yeah. But also, you're quite involved in uh, outdoor and uh, even lino and vinyl floors. And yeah. now you got these uh, laminate uh, floors that are, uh, uh, well, they're actually vinyl. Mm -hmm. So you get involved in cleaning of those as well. Yeah, that's right. Uh, they're very, very common nowadays. So yeah. definitely something we've we've learned into and started working on. Yeah, so when it comes to actually uh, the name Fantastic, mm -hmm. it's it's a fantastic job you do, but the, the whole operation, it's everything to do with floors. Uh, in fact, uh, I'd have to say like uh, hardwood, laminate floors, vinyl floors, uh, even driveways, etc. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So, and concrete? Yeah, that's right. So Getting a, a nice coat on, code on it at the end. So uh, tell the folks, uh, what, what is it you don't clean? I guess really you, you do it all. Uh, yeah, the it's pretty much all surfaces. Uh, even on my spare time, I'm like yard work and stuff, even like that. So. Yeah. So you get involved in everything <laughs> to do with cleaning. That's right. But another nice thing too that I wanted to express here on this video while we're talking to Zachary folks, because I know when you go into our uh, Ask Shell Referral Network members that you're going to see the category of floors, cleaning, ceramic tile, cleaning, all those items are going to be there. But if you live in a condominium or a townhouse development, that that, that is somewhere that you really shine, if yeah. I can use that term, really shine. Because I know you go into a building and all of a sudden uh, uh, Martha starts talking to Mary and Mary starts talking to another neighbor, another neighbor, and all of a sudden you're there for a week in that building. And yeah. that makes a big difference. So you, you, you make that uh, uh, that branding of fantastic, fantastic. Yeah. That's right, yeah. So there you have it. So And, and your phone number, uh, we're going to be putting your phone number right on the bottom. Uh, folks, it'll be going right along the bottom of your screen if you're watching this on your desktop or if you're watching on your phone or even if you're on your laptop, whatever the case may be. When you think of getting that job done around your home, think about, first of all, ask shall dot com that's the referral network you select the category we've got everything in there from uh, well we used to say soup to nuts but everything from the a to z in those services we provide one service trade per uh, job to be done around the home for example zachary with fantastic does all the cleaning work and that makes a big difference because you don't have to Go to two or three or four or five different cleaning companies. We give you one because we know they are number one. So good, better, best. Why worry about the rest when the good is better the better is best? That's Zachary. Thanks, Zachary. Thank you so much. Great job. And uh, folks, until next time, when you need a service and you want to watch the next uh, interview with our service trades, ask Shell.com. It's just that easy. Bye-bye for now.